Okay, this is going to be your login screen whenever you get onto Schoology. So this is where you'll put your username and your password. For you, your username should be um, your first name dot last name. You'll enter your password. And then we're going to put in our zip code 61938. Select Matching Community Unit School District 2 and then click Login. This will take you to your home page. Basically, what you're going to notice is that this looks a lot like Facebook. Um, and there are going to be a couple of things that we're going to look at up here in this top green bar. We've got our courses, our groups, resources, grades, and then we're also going to look at this little message button over here. Let's go down to courses first. When you click on courses, this is going to be all of the different things that you are enrolled in, all of the classes that you are a part of. I'm just going to click on this course. And you're going to see this is where your teacher is going to put all of the resources. So there might be folders, there might be links, uh, there might be assignments or assessments. And this is going to look different from every class, and that's okay. Um, but this is going to be where all of those different resources are located. I'm just going to scroll down. We're just going to click into this folder. Now, one thing that will probably happen is that your um, teachers are going to give you an assignment. It's basically uh, giving you a digital copy of whatever you're going to be working on. I'm going to click on this first one. One thing that's going to be important is that you um, are connected to your school Gmail because when your teachers are assigning you these documents, you have to be logged into your school Gmail. I'm going to go over to my document. Um, and this is going to be where I would be prompted to sign into my account. It says right here that I'm not connected to my Google Drive. So I'm going to click this blue connect button. And I'm going to sign in with my school email address. For you, that should be your first name, last name, last two digits of your birth year at ncusd2.com. And then you're going to put in your password. Once you click next, it's going to take you to this screen just asking if SchoolG can um, access those different things. You're going to hit allow. This will connect you to your drive. Once you do this once, you shouldn't have to do it again. But then you'll have your document um, embedded right in here so that you can edit different things um, in, directly in SchoolG. When you're ready, you would hit this submit assignment button. And then once you hit yes, submit, that's going to submit your assignment. Your teacher will get a notification that you have turned something in. You have to hit that submit assignment um, button. Otherwise, it will not register that it has been submitted. Um, you may also be part of groups. Um, you might be part of like class of 2022 or class of 2023 groups that will have resources that are going to be provided for you. Those will look very much like courses. Your grades will be here as well. So when you click on your grade report, um, that's going to list all of your different courses here. You can click on that course and it'll list your assignments, your participation, all of those different things with your grades. So you have ease of access to those different things. Last thing I want to show you was this little mail button. This mail button is going to be like a direct message, um, like in Facebook or Instagram or anything like that. Um, your teacher may use this to communicate with you or with your class. Um, whenever you have a new message, it'll, it'll have an icon here. Just like I can see, I have a number here on my bell notifications that show me of different things I'm enrolled in. You're going to have that for your message as well. So this is just a, a quick overview of some of the different things that you're going to see within Schoology. Um, if you have any questions, um, by all means, always ask your teacher and your teacher can help you.